Hey everyone, well, let's kick off our crazy Vermont Championship Sports Weekend tonight with a couple baseball and softball title games. Starting at Centennial Field, the top seed Blue Mountain tries to go back to back. Number six, Leyland and Gray stands in their way. The Rebels out to a 2-0 lead in the top of the first as Blue Mountain throws the ball around. The Bucks strike right back, bottom first. It's a two-run double for Brody Kingsbury, Blue Mountain adds another to take a 3-2 lead. After his sloppy first, Bucks pitcher Owen Murray buckles down, striking out the side in the second. In the third, with a runner on first, Murray starts a double play on the comebacker. Leyland and Gray is still looking for that equalizer. Rebels able to get that tying run in the fourth. Chip Winkler lays down the butt, a low a lays down the bunt, a low throw to first, and Spencer Clausen scores his 3-3. Bottom six runner on second. Cameron Roy comes through, smashing the ball into the outfield. Blue Mountain takes the lead and adds two more in the inning, and it's Murray finishing his complete game for the Blue Mountain's second straight title. They beat Leyland and Gray 6-3. I needed to be that guy, and I was that guy. And what can I say, I'm a Murray. You buckle down when things get hard and you do what you need to do, get a win. And that's what we did today. I can't take credit for this entire win. That team back there, they just led me to that win. I may have been on the bump today, but they sure as hell were behind my back. To the D2 softball title game, two-seeded Linden battled number one Enosburg Falls in a rematch of the 2021 championship, which the Vikings won. Vikings jumping all over Enosburg in the second inning, scoring eight straight runs, ending with this RBI single off the bat of Molly Ranadette. Sarah Tanner crosses the plate. It's 8-0. The Hornets lost just one game all season, though, for a reason. Bottom three, Lillian Robtoy hits a bomb towards the fence. She hustles for a two-run triple. Hornets within three. In the fifth, Cameron Benoit hits an infield grounder. Vikings bobble the ball. She beats the throw. That brings in the game's tying run. Incredible, but it doesn't end there. In the sixth, Robtoy once again crushing the ball to the wall. Another triple. Hornets jump in front, it's 9-8, and then they sting Linden, scoring 10 unanswered runs to win the championship 10-8. Our coach Randy told us eight runs is nothing, we can come back from that, it's only the second inning. Never a doubt in my mind that we weren't going to come back. It didn't really hit me at first until I turned around and looked at the scoreboard and realized we were winning. <laughs> That's Enosburg's first softball title since 2008.